Hello, my name is Alex Kessler, and I am with Jamoro Products. Today, we're going to talk about the Jamoro Testarossa, a simultaneous diamond moissanite and white sapphire tester. The Jamoro Testarossa comes in a convenient carrying case, which includes a detailed instruction manual. The tester has a protective cap to cover the testing tip, which has a 10-year warranty. The power button is located on top of the tester. To power on your unit, simply push the power button down once, and in less than 30 seconds, the unit will be powered on. These are all incorrect ways to hold the tester. To receive accurate testing results, the tester must be held with a finger on each finger pad and resting on top of your hand. To avoid false readings from body oil, wipe the stones before testing. Always test the table or flat surface of the stone. When testing, the metal tip must be pushed all the way in. The tester also includes UVF1 technology, which allows you to correctly identify the widest range of electrically conductive moissanite. For best results, clean the tip after multiple tests to remove body oil buildup. Various colors and voice identifications will appear during testing. Remember, you must always hold the ring or jewelry when testing to complete the electrical circuit. Diamond. Moissanite. Metal alert. For sapphire, the tester will light up pink. For CZs, the tester will show no reaction. The testerosa includes a loose stone holder for testing unmounted stones. Make sure your hand is making direct contact with the loose stone holder when testing unmounted stones. For advanced features, keep watching. To change the language on your tester, power on your unit, hold down the power button till you hear the sound option you want, English, Español, then release your finger from the power button to set your tester. The Testerosa comes with a test stone magnifier. This allows you to make proper contact with the testing tip and stone while not accidentally touching the setting or prongs. The Testerosa comes with three rechargeable batteries. When taking the battery door on and off, make sure to not crush the inner battery door tabs as they are fragile. As you can see, the battery door tabs must be slightly separated and equally elevated to make connection with the batteries. If needed, you may gently adjust the battery door tabs. Battery orientation is critical when operating your tester. Always make sure you have one battery with the negative side facing down and two batteries with the positive side facing down. When charging your tester, the battery LED indicator will turn yellow for charging and green for fully charged. If your batteries have incorrect orientation, then when you power on the unit while charging, a red flashing light will appear. If your tester is not charging, check your battery door tabs and battery orientation. Please note, the Testerosa is not intended to identify and separate synthetic diamonds from natural diamonds. If you are testing a synthetic diamond with the Testerosa and receive a moissanite reading, this indicates that the stone is electrically conductive. It also indicates that the stone is likely not a natural diamond. Other than very rare type 2B diamonds, diamonds are not electrically conductive. It is common for synthetic or man-made diamonds to be produced using boron, which like moissanite is also electrically conductive. If you are testing a stone that you believe is a diamond and it is identified as a moissanite, odds are it is a synthetic diamond. Any of our Jamoro dealers would be happy to offer their assistance with your purchasing needs. However, if you have a technical question or require support, please contact Jamoro directly. Thank you for watching.